So again, I am uh, distilling the Citra hops. Last time I was kicked out of the dining room, this time I was kicked out of the house completely because um, the smell is super pungent. And if you don't like um, hops or beer, it's definitely not the thing for you. Um, doing a little differently. I took, I'm guessing, probably about a half a pound, uh, maybe a little bit more, um, ground it up in a Cuisinart uh, food processor, and then stuffed the biomass flask. Um, it's packed in there pretty tight. So I'm hoping to get a, a substantial uh, extraction from this. It's been about two hours, and um, there's a decent amount of, of essential oils there, but um, it was dripping very, very slowly, and that's because it's pretty chilly in the garage, and so I decided to insulate um, the, the biomass flask and the steel arm, and uh, it worked. I've got a good, steady drip. So I'll be excited to see what it looks like in another hour. Very nice. I distilled this for six hours. Um, this is what came out of it as far as essential oils. Um, it looks like I, I probably could have pulled it at about four hours. And I also could have skipped the grinding process. Um, it looks like, you know, just putting in the whole cone hops without grinding them yielded just as much oil. So you can skip that process. Um, it left a ton of resin on the inside of the Cuisinart. So um, yeah, I just put the whole cones in and uh, hope this was helpful. Definitely a, a significant yield compared to what the, the books say. All right, thank you much.